These are some of the ways the United States government has abused its power as the issuer of the world's reserve currency. These are some of the major reasons that caused the BRICS countries to agree on creating their own BRICS currency to trade among themselves and other countries that are members of the BRICS Bank. 1. Financial sanctions, the U.S. government is used its control over the dollar to impose financial sanctions on countries or individuals that don't agree with it. These sanctions can have a devastating impact on the economies of targeted countries, making it difficult for them to do business and trade. 2. Devaluation, the U.S. government can devalue the dollar by printing more money. 3. This can make it cheaper for American companies to export goods and services, but it can also make it more expensive for other countries to buy American goods. 4. Manipulation of interest rates, the U.S. government can manipulate interest rates to its own advantage. 5. For example, it can lower interest rates to stimulate the economy, even if this means that other countries have to raise their interest rates to protect their own economies. 6. Pressure on allies, the U.S. government can pressure its allies to adopt policies that are favorable to the U.S. 7. For example, it can threaten to withhold military aid or trade concessions if an ally does not comply with its demands. These are just some of the ways in which the U.S. government can abuse its power as the issuer of the world's reserve currency. These abuses can have a significant impact on the global economy, and they can also lead to political instability and conflict. In addition to the above, here are some other ways in which the U.S. government has abused its power as the issuer of the world's reserve currency. 1. Using the dollar as a weapon, the U.S. government has used the dollar as a weapon against countries that does not agree with it. 2. For example, it has frozen the assets of foreign governments and individuals, and it has restricted their access to the U.S. financial system. 3. Leveraging the dollar to extract concessions, the U.S. government has used the dollar to leverage concessions from other countries. 4. For example, it has forced other countries to sign trade agreements that are favorable to the U.S., and it has forced them to make concessions on security issues. 5. Imposing economic hardship, the U.S. government has used the dollar to impose economic hardship on other countries. 6. For example, it has devalued the dollar, which has made it more expensive for other countries to buy American goods. 7. This has led to job losses and economic hardship in other countries. The abuses of the U.S. government as the issuer of the world's reserve currency have a number of negative consequences. They lead to financial instability, economic hardship, and political instability. They also undermine the trust that other countries have in the U.S. dollar, which will lead to the dollar losing its status as the world's reserve currency. Thanks for watching.